After the events with the Pirate Queen and the Consortium, you guys have decided to lay low. Well, low for you at least. And uh, head to Narshada, which is the Smuggler's Moon. It's, it's in hut space in the Outer Rim, so you might have a few enemies running around here, but with all these pirates everywhere, you're going to blend in a lot better than you did on that gambling planet, for example. So while you're here, JB has paid to have several upgrades added to DJ9, who now has a name and a personality and a bunch of stuff that will yes. surprise you when it shows up. Uh, some of it's portable, some of it is not portable. He'll be much more helpful, you know, whether you're on an adventure or if he's staying back to guard the ship, whatever. Uh, you know, the droid has definitely uh, come into his own this session. But you have to go pick him up, you have to go pay the bill. You know, while you're off doing that, uh, it would be a good idea if Ral sits there and studies the astro charts to figure out what the heck is going to happen next. You know, maybe plan some things in advance, whatever, or, or go on in adventures and do whatever you want. That's up to you. Uh, this is hut space. You're not entirely sure that Timo the hut is not out here looking for you, putting a price on your heads and such for you know the, the adventure with stealing the ship. So uh, it's best to have an exit plan in mind. And uh, Kuwata and K Man can be out browsing the local shops. There's, uh, you know, there's basically it's your basic pirate planet. Anything you think you can find, you can probably find if you look long enough. How much for the little girl? <laughs> Except that. So, I children. I want to buy your children. There's one item that I have been uh, looking for uh, last couple of uh, missions. I, w I would like to get a Bible blade. <clears throat> I'm sure you could find one here somewhere. I like to uh, Bible there's blade. Multiple arm shops. There's uh, places to upgrade armor and tech. There's you know, every oh, every well. ship part, and obviously the the droid uh, the droid factory there where. The black market people have upgraded everything, so you guys have money right now. Anything you want is pretty much available, right, but it spends well, if quickly. I'm gonna do a, if I'm yeah. going to do a shopping list, just a couple of Fibro items. Blade is going to be uh, a cheap option on a smuggler planet. You're not going to have to spend much for that. In fact, if you're not okay. careful, you'll just get one because someone will stick it in you. you know. <laughs> what about that that um that electrified baton? Or even some light armor, not like you know stormtrooper armor, but just like light armor, you know, to help with my two soak. <laughs> if I can get a little yeah. more love, because I was hoping to get some armor so I could bump my soak up to at least a four, a, a point or two. Yes. Is there anything that we can do for that? So, uh, uh, yeah, sure. Yeah, you can you can shop for all that stuff. All right, some, you, you, for, uh, some places might have better prices than others, but uh, you know, while you're here, you might as well get what's available. So what the heck? All right, I want to go to the first shop and, yeah. uh, and take a look at just that couple of couple of uh, items. Those are the three items that I'm looking for. Yeah, I, I ask you to please pick up some armor for me. I'm gonna hang back on the ship and make sure okay. that we've got our exit strategy in place. One and two that I'm, you know. Checking our navigation. Okay, so is it just like a like a normal like a bazaar type situation where they got the little shops on both sides of the street? <laughs> uh, I, I'm looking for security spikes and uh, possibly a portable computer. But you have to go pick up. He said you have to pick up. Yeah, DJ, not that same area. Okay. Yep. Yeah. Everything. Yeah, I'm thinking the, of the tech that. shop. The tech shop will be built in there, so you can do all your one-stop thing there. Uh, anything you need as nice. far as that stuff. You know, if you want, you already have a personal Space portable smart. computer, but if you need a better oh, one, they have yeah. they have better ones. Data pads, everything. Oh, it's I'll a smuggler's that, yeah. paradise. Smuggler's I'm just, but yeah, I would like some security spikes. I don't think I have any of those yet. You do have a couple, but uh, they are expendable. So they're. Uh, I think you used one of the two that you were given at one point. So I'm looking at like five of them. Carry around. All right. Well, let's. I don't uh, know what that costs. Well, let's run this piece by piece since you guys are going to be split off. We'll start with with JB. So you arrive at the show. Hey, how's it going, man? We got your droid ready for you. You know he's up and running and. and Kind of a nutball. I'm not exactly sure what to make of this guy, but we programmed him up the way you wanted, added all the upgrades you wanted. He's your problem now. <laughs> all right. <laughs> oh, man. Proud DJ Papa. Nine, you ready to kill something? <laughs> Got a loose cannon. No, sir. 
He's ready to rock. shoot something? No, sir. <laughs> I guess he needs a little bit of work. <laughs> okay. Well, you'll get to, uh, you'll get to fine tune that programming. <laughs> yeah. I'm looking for some security spikes. Oh, sure. Did you want the uh, you know, the basic ones or do you want the hardcore stuff? Four basic ones, one hardcore. All right, no problem. We get some of them, gather those up for you. What else you want? You, know, you, you look like a, a person who's interested in tech. Uh, I don't know if you'd have it here. Do you have a personal shield? Uh, yes, but not. They're not great. We have some pretty pretty weak ones. Mm. Upgrade. Uh, somebody just came in here and bought like a three dozen of them, uh, the good ones. So I don't know if someone's gearing up for a big mission or, or what that was about, but I don't ask. I just take the money and go, you know. How about uh, five encrypted comlinks, which can be incorporated into the helmet if, if desired? All right. I think I got a box full of those for you right here. <clears throat> uh, I can't think of anything else. Did you want to upgrade a data pad? Uh, no, I'm kind of sentimental about myself. Okay. <laughs> Tell fails on me, I'm, I'm not going to get into one. <laughs> the, the dice are behind his existing data pad, so yeah, might as well stick with that one. Yeah. <laughs> True. So All right. DJ9, are you sure you don't want to shoot anybody? <laughs> no, sir. <laughs> he, he doesn't want to kill people just to take stuff. He wants to make sure there's a good reason to do it, right? You'll lift boxes, but you won't shoot. Okay, yeah. we'll work on He's that. got a we'll grudge. It's good. Okay. So we got the data spikes, one Uber spike for throwaways. We got the encrypted comlinks. Uh, oh yes, uh, here's a tough one for you. I want a chip transponder, if you could get one that has multiple identities registered to We actually, yes, we talked about that. I'm not there. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, hey, yeah, I could, I can, I can make that happen, but it's gonna take me a little while to get the the stuff. To, I don't have that here, but I do have one stashed nearby. If you want to come back, you know, later on, maybe, maybe around sundown, and pick that up. Absolutely. What's the cost on that? I know that's not cheap. Uh, most likely, if it's if it's where I think it is, it's gonna probably be about twenty thousand. And how many uh, IDs does it have on it? It's got four. Oh, nice, nice. Uh, that's it. Cool. Well, that's the end of my shopping day. And, uh, yeah, you obviously. JB is lucky I'm not there because twenty thousand dollars for four IDs <laughs> is a fucking steep. <laughs> I'm talking about a crooked transponder for a ship. We're trying to fool the empire here. I am just saying this twenty G's is a little steep. No, that's not like, for that. That's I, eighteen. I, if it's I was, a dollar, I say at some point a trip more. back to the casino where Ralphie D scores again. You know? <laughs> no, I, I actually expected it to be more. Okay, so, so how that much was in fact, I, I was giving you a good deal because you've already spent so much in here on all the other stuff. You know, it's kind of a package. Right, you're at 100k right now, man. Yeah, I know. I, I spent the money on the droid already. How much for the spikes, <laughs> the comlinks, and the transponder? Yeah, that's a lot of money. <laughs> a lot of money. <laughs> well, uh, actually, uh, you give me the twenty thousand for the transponder. I'll throw in the spikes and the, the other stuff there. Oh, awesome. <laughs> okay, nice. This is. No, they might have uh, they might have my logo branded on them, you know, as, as an advertisement. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> mm. is racking up the so we rob a bank. I don't know. Who <laughs> I need to go to. I mean, if I use my card to try to get my armor and it gets denied, I'll be pissed because <laughs> everything went to DJ Nine. Oh man, my wife spent so much money today. I didn't know. <laughs> who let JB go shopping first? <laughs> Now, as far as uh, pirates in that universe at the moment, you guys are, are fairly well off. I mean, not uh, not you know thinking rich, but definitely enough to buy the you know. It's going to be more advantageous to you to buy things that make things easy and keep you alive than it is to hoard that cash. Right. I agree. That's it for me. Glad you can't take. It. I think I've spent enough. I think you have. All right. All right. Uh, so JB and uh, DJ Nine have wandered off into the streets to do their thing until later on when he's going to go pick up his stuff. Uh, who wants Let's to talk about the importance of shooting people? Um, I would be me you, and you can go do target practice. That's good. Good idea. Okay. Teach him how to shoot. <laughs> All right. So you guys are off wandering the bazaar. What are you looking for? You're mostly looking for personal upgrades and weaponry. Personal. 
personal upgrades and weaponry. So uh, light armor for for me and Rail, um, viral blade, stun baton for myself, and man, what did what did you want? No, I'm okay. You're good. Um, or he's just rolling. <laughs> yeah, his his armor is already pretty good stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Like I said, my soak is at a two. <laughs> and when I got into that last fight, I got I took one hit and I was like, oh god, I'm almost dead. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well that's uh that's how it goes. But also, yeah, it didn't go up as you increased to a newer sheet either, so that wasn't uh the only way to really fix that is the way you're trying to fix it now by armoring up. So, yeah, the, yeah. Uh, the problem with that, as far as we're doing here, is that uh, you won't have the sheets with the new data today, but that's okay. We can still uh, prepare. <clears throat> so you know, we'll, we'll find you what you need and we'll get it all going, and then the next sheet will reflect the, the new numbers. <laughs> that's fine. That's fine. So uh, let me just go ahead and uh, what's the damage on... Uh, Oh, uh, let's see here. I can't actually open that up at the moment. Uh, let's see. We're going to go for two basic armors, vibro blades. We'll throw in the vibro blades. Those are like a gift to you yes. for your purchase. Uh, do you want the, the bio restorative underlays on the armor? Where you can, uh, yes. if you, it'll basically remove one wound every time you've, you've had a battle. You know, you got to yes. stop. Okay. And it actually gives you a, a blue dye to a medicine check too. So that's good. <clears throat> All right, so that's 10, 12. Oh, one of those for everyone, yeah. <laughs> All right, let's see. So we'd go with, uh, are you buying JB armor? Or is JB armor considered the droid? Uh, no, he's good. Oh, yeah. <laughs> like, oh, okay, you spent uh, too much. Slicer. I'll, I'll hide behind DJ Dude, I am right. trying to get my stuff up to JB status. I'm so low. <laughs> <laughs> good plan, good plan. Okay, so two I'm sets of armor. Basically out here in a, ch in a oh, open chest neck. blouse and, and some pants. <laughs> Comfort over. Looking like Earl Flynn. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, two sets of armor, three bio-restorative players, and then what, two vibroblades. Uh, five. That's going to cost you 7,500 credits. Sounds good. 7,500 credits. Couldn't talk your way down. Yeah, that's a good price. That's a good price. I know you got it. I don't want to use my charm on the... Yeah, on the little things. Yeah. Yeah. Not, not going to haggle. Yeah, that's actually on a, on a yeah. smuggler's planet. That's a good way to get everybody to shut the doors on you anyway. So exactly. <laughs> My prices are already as low as they get. <laughs> Plus he's throwing in free stuff. I'll, you know, I'll start charging you a nickel and dime, man. <laughs> All right, so you guys are so set I up. I think it's time to go to a uh, to a patron of scum and villainy, where maybe we can find our next assignment. All right, so you're going to wander out and sort of head towards the cantina. Yeah. All right. <clears throat> and so me and, me and man are out trying to drum up some extra business too. Here's the thing. Um, let me ask the. Uh, GM first. Uh, I, I want to upgrade the handling on the crate fang. I'm at a minus one. <laughs> Will this come into play at all? Because uh, oh, it is a minus one. Minus one. one. Bad. Yeah, minus one is not great. That's mostly That's due to the size and the shape of the ship. But uh, we can look into some upgrades for that. There's probably I'm sure there's going to be some way to do it. Better now. That's true. If you're piloting it much better, and you were piloting your ass off with those. Negatives, and you just didn't know it. You know what? That's true. You know what? I'll... We trust you as a pilot. All right. It's like JB with the data pad, man. Don't change. We already put some upgrades on the ship. <laughs> yeah, well, you have a, you have a four in piloting, so you've got uh, two yellows and two greens. That's pretty good. All right. I'll, I'll hang back and wait until you know it's needed. To My piloting is still too green, <laughs> but I am the captain of the ship. Hey. Captain. Well, you're the captain. That means you tell everybody what to do. You know, did you ever see like Picard or Kirk fly the ship? No. <laughs> so, fly the ship. 
you know, hey, the see, I was always a Star Wars guy, so that always bothered me about them that they didn't actually pilot. <laughs> like, hey, man, yeah. you're supposed to be behind the game. Yeah, yeah, but technically, like, they always, like, Han Solo was supposed to be the captain, but not necessarily yeah, the Chewie pilot, because Chewie pilot. was the pilot. But they were both, you know, that ship takes two to run because it handles like shit and has a minus one on handling. <laughs> <laughs> hey, all right, I get it. <laughs> Also has a faulty hyperdrive because it goes 0.5 past light speed and causes <laughs> hyperdrive failure. Yeah, mm. several, several things. Yeah. Well, hopefully right, you guys can a... keep your droid from becoming a part of the ship so that it doesn't become a, a homicidal maniac or whatever. <laughs> no, 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 no. That was weird. And, and you know what? I'm not going to get into that. I'm just afraid he's not. He's going to be the opposite of a homicidal maniac. That's a pacifist. <laughs> It made uh, fall somewhere. I'll work on his personality. Good deal. All right, so, so uh, you, we'll do the Star Wars wipe. You guys are all headed towards the same place, basically, at this point. And uh, are you going to go out and look for him, Ral, or are you going to just sit there and wait and lay low until oh. they get back? Sorry to pause again. Uh, are we <laughs> fast-forwarding past me, picking up the transponder and installing it in the ship? No. Or before that? No, we're, we're fast-forwarding up until you guys get back together. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. So, yeah, I'll, I'll look for him. Yeah. So you're going to go out and wander too. So now that you've done your job, you're going to take in the sights and uh, and see what kind of trouble you can get into. This is Definitely. Good. And uh, as you're... Each and looks pretty formidable, doesn't they? <laughs> yeah, we're about to go into this bar, though, and there's no droids allowed. That's all right. There's a slight problem with Uh, I'm Donna. Pull yourself together. Come on, let's get in the character.